Hi there, it's Jojo the Thrifty Teacher here with another haul. I am a part-time, <laughs> sorry, I have a, a foster dog next to me. And when I started talking, he was like, oh, what are you doing? His name is Riker. He's available for adoption. Um, he's the best boy. Anyway, I am a part-time reseller, full-time educator. Excuse my appearance. I just woke up from a nap, and I thought it was the next day. And I was like, I haven't listed today. I haven't. I did a bunch of other things today. And then I took a nap and was like, is it Monday already? No. No. Uh, I do not edit my videos, so hence I just put my hair up and said I need to do a haul. A couple things. Uh, he's chewing on a bone, if that's the noise you hear. I, uh... I sold a chair for $800. Um, I sold it on uh, Facebook Marketplace. Um, I was gifted it a couple years ago, and it was too heavy and too big for my spot. And it is actually a $3,500 chair. Um, and I had it listed for $1,500. I said the lowest I'd go is 1000 and then when the person was sitting in it, I we both realized it's a little loose. So I said eight hundred. I don't want it back in the house. It was funny. It was really funny the whole the whole thing. He was like, "Oh, you're really selling it," and I was like, "It's heavy." He didn't believe me till he went to pick it up, and he had a look on his face. And I said, "I told you it's heavy." The chair is called Life Form, and it was like a executive um, office chair, leather. Anyway, let's get into the haul. So this, I looked at it at first and I was like, mm, this just looks like something, whatever. And then I was like, but let me just look it up. It's by Parcel. So these bags um, online are selling uh, used for between $30 and $50. I paid $6.49 minus 20%. It's a pretty cool bag. I ain't gonna lie. Pretty cool bag. You're a good boy. Um, I paid up for this one. But look at this, right? So it has the real leather and it has the suede. And it's just, it's really constructed well. It is dirty. I'm going to have to clean it. But, so I paid $7.49, which isn't bad compared to this one, minus 20%. Everything here got minus, wait. 25 or whatever the teacher discount is on Sundays. Genuine leather uh, made in old lady eyes, Argentina. But look, it's J. Jill. I love J. Jill. Can you believe it? So I'm going to have to clean that up a little bit. Excuse my nose. Um, let's see here. Oh, this... Uh, so does anybody know what this is? This uh, I got from a different store. Um, these next couple of things I'll show you I got from a different store. I got 25% off because um, I'm a teacher. So anybody know what this is? It's wood. Got it for 75 cents. It was a dollar. I got it with my discount for 75 cents. A lady next to me when I was looking said, hey, do you know what this is? And I said, nope, let's Google Lens it. And it's for yarn. Isn't that cool? She goes, I don't need it. I don't knit. And I said, I'll buy it. And I think when I looked online just real quick, they were going from like 15 to 20 some dollars. But I just thought it was cool. You can tell it's handmade, you know. I spent $68 there. And got this. Isn't this cute? I didn't even look up the brand because this has so much going for it. It's a lagging look, which means you can layer it. It's boho. It has different textiles on it. It could be western. This was some... Um, 
I don't even know what the, oh, there it is. Price tag was $6 minus 25%. It is Karat, Kyra, Karat. I don't know what F means. Does it have anything else on the inside? Hmm. What the heck does F mean? Free size? No. This has got to be a small or a medium. Small? Medium? I don't know. So I basically bought it for style. This was $8 minus 25%. Not my style, but it's a vest with the brocade on the front. And I looked it up. Here's the... Made in India, British Kayaki by Robert Lighton. The size is all jacked up. So um, this, I looked up, and these can go for about 50 bucks. It's definitely handmade. This is another one that I was like, mm. I didn't look it up, and it was a little bit more than I wanted to pay for. $10, size small. So the small and the in ten dollars. Ooh, here's the brand. I don't know. Does that say Vocal, made in USA? I this again. I bought it for style. It has some stuff going for it. It is a size small, but I figure you can wear it as a dress or you can wear it. Um, as tunic with leggings but if I can get 25 for it that'd be great these I bought for myself I think yeah I bought these for myself these were seven dollars they're Coldwater Creek people were so friendly there there was another lady there and we were talking about different things she's gotten and she looked at these and she's like well these are interesting they remind me of the 70s and I was like really they remind me of just like a flowy summer look they're 54 percent linen that's why I think and I'm like ah, do I even have a shirt that matches that anything like that but I figure I can buy a navy blue or like a um like a tan but I like them. So there's that. And then I got these. I didn't look these up. But I had to have them. Look at. Look at him. Isn't he cute? Oh, these look like they came from Marshalls or something. Interesting. What's it say on here? Made in Italy. This was $18. Howling Dalmatian Zampiva. I don't know. $18 minus 25%. They're so cute. They had cats there too, but this was 25. Zampiva for Howling Dalmatians figurine. Yeah, Zampiva. It's marked on there. But look at it. They're so cute had to have them and I figure like okay if I can get my money back on them that's fine
Yeah, they had a cat there and they had something else. But I didn't want the cat. And then this one was 18 as well. I think they priced them too high, but look at him. They're so cute. So I'll have to look those up and see what we have going on. All right, what am I at? 10 minutes. Okay, let me show you a couple other things. This stuff I did not get a discount on because I went to a, re a consignment place. But I always look really well because they price up their stuff. This was eight, $18. And sometimes, guys, you have to pay up a little bit when you know you can make a good profit. Somersault is a very good brand. I have one other thing that's a cashmere uh, tracksuit kind of. It hasn't sold yet. Because it is pricey, but um, I just thought this would sell based on the name and based on the style for spring and summer. But I just love it. Look at this dress, right? And then look at, it's like the handkerchief hem. Can you see that? I can't see you. <laughs> it's a handkerchief hem. Because that, it V's down on the sides. So that's a handkerchief hem. I just thought it was so cute. And I'll probably sell this for like 50. List it for 50. Take like 42 maybe. 53% um, organic cotton. 43% recycled polyester. 4% spandex. The lining is 100% cotton. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. Lining is 100% cotton. That doesn't make sense. Is there another dress underneath it or with it? I don't know. Oh, wait, do I have? Okay, yeah. And this is the only other thing I bought there. And I paid up for it, but I want it. And I'll, I'll list it, but I wanted it for myself. So look at the cute little Brighton bag. paid $29 for it. But look, it still has the original stickers on it. How much did they have it listed for, did they say? $52. Look at it. I love Brighton stuff. Isn't that cute? And it has the... I just love Brighton stuff because it's so well made. But I just love it. And I love that it has the original bag. I will sell it for 52 or I'm not selling it, you know, or more. And then I bought these again. I will resell them, but I wanted them for myself. These are sterling silver. I paid 24 for these. I just thought they were so dainty and pretty. I like the little flower detail. And they are marked sterling on the back. You can see it written right there. But I just thought these were so beautiful. So I got those. Yes, I did pay up for them, but if I'm going to wear them for myself, who cares, right? Back to the Goodwill. This was $5.99 minus 20%. This is Barbizon. So this will probably sell for about $35. So it's the top and the bottoms. Which I usually don't pick up Barbizon a lot unless it has something special about it. Because it does sell for about 20 bucks. But I think with the set and it being so cute that it'll sell for more. And then... Oh yeah. this I was excited about this too. I think this is Lauren Ralph Lauren. Yeah. Lauren Ralph Lauren. Size medium. $7.99 minus 20%. But it's a nice robe. And it has a tie still. There was another robe there that the brand sells for about 50 or 60 bucks, but it had the 
resort around here it had their name on it which isn't a big deal but i was like i don't want to hold on to it for something for like that you know just don't want to hold on to it um and then i'll show you one more thing i really love nightgowns and robes and all that stuff this was $4.99 minus 20 percent And this is why, like, sometimes it's okay to pay up for certain things because you're going to make money on other things. So this is Stan Herman. I looked at this and I was like, wow, that's a really good quality robe. Um, it is made in USA, size medium. Let's see. 100% cotton. <coughs> Look at this. Is this a robe? No, it's not. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a house robe. But then it has the zip. I did check it and it's a YKK zip. So, you know, it's vintage or a good zipper, but I just, I love, I love this stuff. I love how soft this is. I love how heavy it is. It's cotton. So it'll soak up the water. I just love it. I love nightgowns and stuff like that. I love selling them. I love listing them. I love photographing them. I just love it all. Um, so I do have another uh, bag and I will do another video. Um, I forgot I had this and then I found it the other day and I was like, oh my God. And I have listed everything I've photographed up to this point. Well, not really, but I don't want to list those things right yet. Because there's a lot of research I need to do with them because they're like photographs that don't have a signature or they do, but I can't read it and blah, blah, blah. Um, anyway, I'm Jojo the Thrifty Teacher. I'm going to do a part two of the haul with some pretty, you know, when you look at stuff and you're like, oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, look at that belt. Oh, look at that sweater. So um, you can look at some of the stuff that I have listed uh, at Jojo the Thrifty Teacher. Is that a gray hair? Or is that a bald spot? I think that's... Okay, that was discreet. Sorry. <laughs> Jojo the Thrifty Teacher, thank you for joining me. I'm a part-time educator, full-time... No. Full-time educator, part-time reseller. I don't edit my videos. I will talk to you soon. I hope you have a great day.